Question 3, uh, you're given y equals 4x, take 1 in a bracket to the power of 12, find dy by dx. Okay, now the process is relatively simple. You imagine that's a great big x, and you do 12 times that to the power of 11 that you'd imagine was a big x. Obviously it's not an x, it's 4x, take 1. And the idea is to multiply by what that is differentiated. To differentiate 4x, take 1, you get 4 times 12 gives 48 times 4x take 1 to the power of 11. So we'll just recap. 12 times the bracket to the power of 11 times it by differentiate 4x take 1, 4. 4 12s are 48 and there we have it there, dy by dx. Let's move on to question 4. Find the value of k for which the equation x squared plus 4x plus k take 5 in a bracket equals 0 has equal roots. Okay, uh, well, it has equal roots, uh, thinking back to nat, uh, nat 5, when the discriminant, the part of the quadratic formula, is equal to 0. So, uh, b squared minus 4ac, so it's ax squared, so a is 1, plus bx, so b is 4, plus c, c is k take 5, so these are what we are going to use for our discriminant. b squared minus 4ac, 4 squared minus 4 times 1 times k take 5 is 0. 4 squared of course is 16. Uh, take, just taking my time here, 4 ones are 4, times k take 5 is 0. Uh, multiply through, uh, minus 4k, minus minus plus 4 fives are 20. Uh, 16 add 20, of course, is 36. Move the 4k over, change the sign. So 36 is 4k. 36 over 4 gives you k, so k is 9.